Well, good morning, friends. Today we will discuss uh, some uh, uh, English aspects, which is very important. As you know, the instruments in English literature are instruments in science. So, in literature, we have many uh, instruments. So, as also in the science, also we have many many instruments like your barometer, barograph, cardiograph, like your uh, accelerometer, aerometer, accelerometer, altimeter, amenometer, anemograph, altimeter, barograph, barometer, oxometer, optometer, luxometer, scintillometer. So many things are there. But uh, we have to understand the basics of these words in English literature so that we will definitely correct answers in question papers, whatever those IS examination is concerned. And we have to keep in mind that some of these instruments are having Greek root and some of the, these uh, words having also uh, origin in Latin words. So let's discuss today uh, those instruments in science. Okay, dear. Just see, we have first I have discussed that, that is your accelerometer. You see, accelerometer. You see, just to keep this, see this word, acceleration. You know? Acceleration means that is your in science to uh, speed up something, right? So, accelerometer means uh, not that the A is equal to velocity by time. In science, you know, velocity by time is your uh, acceleration. Anyway, and uh, force is mass interactions. Okay, you forget this one. Just see, accelerometer means which uh, speeds something. That means if it is uh, like this, like this, like this, and if you are doing something to encourage, that is accelerometer. That means one instrument that is used to uh, used to verify the growth. That is not accelerometer, right? Another thing is we have to understand. Another thing. Another thing we have to understand that is aerometer. Aerometer. Aerometer means that is something related to atmosphere, something related to all those atmospheric, uh, you say, height, atmospheric uh, particles, all things. So, aerometer, right? Another thing is acid meter. ACD meter. ACD meter means uh, that instrument which is used for calculating acidity. So acidity is measured by acidimeter, right? Altimeter. Altimeter. Very simple. Meter is meter. You see meter is here, meter is here. And alti means actually altitude. Altitude. But alto means height. Do not confuse with alto and alti. Alti is your uh, uh, that is uh, altitude, that is height. Right? And alto means also height. But altitude is related to more to atmosphere and alto is related to more to height only. So keep in mind, altimeter instrument used for measuring altitude. Right. Next one is your uh, animograph. Animograph. Animograph, just see, animograph. Animometer means uh, that is uh, one instrument used for calculating that uh, wind, wind, that is wind speed. So you have to keep in mind the wind speed so that uh, it will uh, help you. Another thing is audimeter. 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 What is audimeter actually? Audimeter means uh, something which is used for measuring sound. Okay, what it means sound in Greek literature? In Greek literature, sound. So, audimeter. Another thing is barograph. B A R O G R A P H. What is barograph? Bar means atmospheric pressure. So, instrument used for measuring the pressure inside the atmosphere in the atmosphere is the barometer. Right. Another thing is methanometer. Let it be methanometer. Methanometer. What is methanometer? Actually, this word you can see methane is here. So, methane, methane is here. So, that is methane. If you use uh, uh, one instrument to measure the power of methane or the concentration of methane, that is known as a methanometer. Okay, alright. Another thing is optometer. Optometer means 
testing eyes. You might have seen many doctors they are known as using optometer. Right? Optometer is one instrument used by that is ophthalmologist. Ophthalmologist. O P T H. Ophthalmologist. Right? So logist means one scientist or doctor or one who studies research. Right? So ophthalmologist. Ophthal means eye. So eye doctor uses your ophthal optometer. So ophthalmologist uses optometer. So just keep in mind. Optometer, ophthalmologist. Optometer, ophthalmologist. Like this. Nothing else. Another thing we will discuss right now that is, uh, that is uh, very important. That is megascope. 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 Right? Scope means that is also one type of meter or used for counting something. So mega means big. Right? Something bigger things like you may what is or any item that is measured by your mega scope. Right? Another thing is your micronometer. Very important. Micronometer. Micro means small. Micro means small. I say micronometer. Very simple but very interesting. Micro means small. Right? But forget this right now. Chrono means time. Are you getting my point? So, time, that means small parts of time, bits of time is measured by this uh, micronometer. See here. Micronometer. So, time again. Right? Another thing is, we have to understand that is scintillometer. Scintillometer. Scintillometer means uh, those uh, scientific instruments used for uh, measuring the distance of those, uh, uh, like uh, in space, like in uh, uh, 1600, 1400 km above, that is known as uh, space, that is scintillometer. Now we will discuss photoscope. What is photoscope? Actually, ionized particle. Photo means ionized particle. Just remember, photo means ionized particle. Ionized particle. So, one instrument which is used for calculating those uh, portion amount of uh, ionized particle is known as your uh, photoscope. Right? Micrograph, micrograph, you know. Uh, those instruments which are used for uh, calculating those bigger things. Macro means big, uh, micro means small. Anyway. What is OO meter? O meter. O meter is very interesting. Please uh, see here what is O meter. Just see. O, o meter. This is O meter. What is O meter? Do you know Ulogy? Logy means study. Right? O, o means A. So X study, a study of X, study of X is known as Ulog. So we can say O meter is your something which is used for the purity of the about the X, about the protein, about the uh, that is uh, whatever you say, separate size and whatever those constituents properties of those X is known as your O meter, right? Now we will discuss solarimeter. What is solarimeter? Just the solarimeter. Solar means solar sun as usual. So solarimeter means radiation, the sun radiation. That means one instrument which is used to, to calculate the intensity of radiation of earth, uh, sun. That is sun rays coming to earth, uh, it takes uh, near about 8 minutes, that is uh, near about 480 seconds or 500 seconds to reach that. So, we can say solar emitter means radiation color. Okay, can you? Now, we will discuss heliograph. Heliograph or heliometer. What is heliograph? Heliograph means those sun color, heat color, temperature. So, that is the uh, intensity of heat, intensity of temperature, that is from sun. Same thing, little, little difference is there. Solar emitter and heliometer, heliograph, there is a little little difference, just you have to keep in mind, right? Whenever this heliometer, heliograph is concerned, whenever heliometer is concerned, or solar emitter is concerned, just keep in mind one word, that is storm. So storm is uh, just, uh, you, have, you have to touch this heliograph and heliometer. Anyway, now we will discuss endoscope. In medical science and uh, science, you might have uh, uh, heard about endoscope. What is endoscope?
endo actually. Endo means inside. That right? one man is here, suppose, right? What is inside is the body. What is inside is body. Suppose stomach is here, right? Stomach is here. And some uh, instrument used to measure measure uh, whatever problem is there inside it, inside human body, right? It is a man. That is known as an endoscopy. Endoscopy. Right? I will get to my point. So endoscopy as usual. Right? Another word we have to discuss right now. That is uh, pyrometer. What is pyrometer? Just say pyrometer. Do you know what is pyro? Pyro means fire. So fire means then how to calculate fire? Actually, it's not fire actually. It is related to temperature. So uh, one instrument which is used to uh, calculate or to measure right, the intensity of temperature of fire is known as a pyrometer. Do you uh, know that is a pyrograph? Means the those temperature of pyrophobia. Do you know pyrophobia? Pyrophobia. <laughs> Very nice question. Phobia means fear. And fire means fire. <laughs> Some children, uh, you, know, you might have in school days and small uh, childhood days, uh, maybe uh, used to fear this fire. So this is fire, fire phobia. <laughs> Another thing we will discuss right now, cryometer. Actually, cryo means lower temperature. Lower temperature. So cryo means lower temperature. So cryometer means that instrument which is used for measuring the lower temperature of the things. Cryogenic engines, do you know cryogenic engines? Cryogenic engines. Cryogenic engines. Cryogenic engines means those engines which function under or below the lower temperature, uh, minus one temperature, it's known as cryo engines. Cryometer. So it is related to low temperature, my dear. Anyway. Now we will discuss another important thing. Okay, do you know uh, my friends uh, that is Lux? Just see here, Lux, L-U-X. Do you know Lux? I know Lux. Uh, you know this is a company, right? So company. And uh, so company. Very nice. Company. But uh, Lux is also a unit of, a unit of, unit of uh, illumination. Unit of illumination. So keep in mind always, illumination means intensity of illumination is measured by one instrument that is related to loss, that is known as your loss meter. Very simple. Some of my friends say that you are loss, you are looking like next nice, loss. But I say, why should I look like a so? <laughs> anyway, so now we will discuss uh, one important thing that is, uh, okay, methanometer is over, megascope over, microscope. So this is 
इन साइकिल पर क्या बोलते साइकिल मींस राउंड राइट सो साइकिल मीटर मींस दिस द इंस्ट्रूमेंट व्हिच यूज्ड फॉर राइट टू व्यू दोस सर्कल्स इज नोन एज अ साइकिल जस्ट सी हियर साइक्लोमीटर आर यू गेटिंग माय पॉइंट्स सर्कल्स एनीवे अनदर थिंग इज वी हैव टू रिमेंबर दैट इज इलेक्ट्रो निग्राफ इलेक्ट्रो निग्राफ मींस दोस इंस्ट्रूमेंट व्हिच आर यूज्ड टू मेजर द इलेक्ट्रॉन्स दैट इज इलेक्ट्रॉन मींस द स्पीड ऑफ इलेक्ट्रॉन्स ऑल दिस इज नोन एज इलेक्ट्रो निग्राफ लास्ट वन इज कार्डियोग्राफ जस्ट सी हियर कार्डियोग्राफ कार्डियोग्राफ एक्चुअली कार्डियो मींस दैट इज हार्ट राइट सो कीप योर हार्ट इन दैट सो कार्डियो मींस हार्ट कार्डियोग्राफ मींस हार्ट विल बी मेडिकल यू माइट हैव सीन दिस फिगर इज मूविंग लाइक दिस 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 कार्डियो कार्डियोमीटर सो एनीवे टुडे वी डिस्कस अबाउट दोस इंस्ट्रूमेंट्स इन साइंस एंड टेक्नोलॉजी इवन आल्सो इन इंग्लिश लिटरेचर सो इट इज वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट फॉर लिटरेचर इट इज वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट फॉर साइंस so we have many many list uh, but you have to at least remember all these instruments in english literature that so that you can understand all the basics of those uh, uh, question papers right so anyway thank you very much wish you happy